Well, good morning. This morning our scriptures found in Psalms, chapter 145, verse 16, it goes like this. Thou openest thine hand and satisfiest the desires of every living thing. Back in the 1960s, uh, Peggy Lee, she recorded a song called, Is That All There Is? And, uh, you know, it, she the song went to a you know a bleak outlook on the world and and how discontent and everything that uh, she she tried to do is that all there is and uh what a what a way to look on you know the outlook and and many folks suffer from that is this all there is and uh you know, uh, uh, the Rolling Stones come out with the song, uh, I Can't Get No Satisfaction. And I try and I try and I try and I try and I still can't get no satisfaction. No, there is no satisfaction without Jesus Christ in your life. I don't care what you do. Drugs and alcohol cannot replace it. All that does is just numb. And it soon goes away. Back uh, years ago, uh, a friend of mine wrote a song. You'll stop searching when you start serving Jesus Christ. And it goes like this. You'll stop searching when you start serving Jesus Christ. You'll be happy when he is in your life. Seek him with your whole heart and you'll find. You'll stop searching when you start serving Jesus Christ. You know, apart from Jesus life outlook on life is just bleak it's it just looks like there's no hope everything goes wrong seems like yeah and, and it's to me it's like driving around with four flats on your car you don't get nowhere very fast at all and you're just a wondering if you can keep it going c.s lewis said, if we find ourselves with a desire that nothing in the world can satisfy, the most probable explanation is that we were made for another world. Yes, we were made by God to live with him. But we have to accept his, his son, Jesus Christ, the one that died on the cross for us. We have to accept him in our life and let him be our Lord and Savior and follow his commandments. That's, that's the only satisfaction you're going to find. Everything this world offers you, it won't bring lasting joy, but he can bring joy to you. He sure can. Once you ask him into your heart, your whole outlook on life changes. And yes, you will be satisfied. Sure will. Well, I hope this helps someone today. May God richly bless you. I love you, but better yet, Jesus loves you. He died on the cross for us, and we'll see you soon. Bye-bye now.